Let's go to the telephones. Uh, Jake the Snake Roberts is with us, and we've got Jeff from Dunwoody. Hi, Jeff. Hi. How you doing, Jeff? I'm fine. Wait, who did you say NWA champion was? The NWA champion is Mashahiro Chono, who beat Ravishing Rick Rude in the finals. Yeah, and um, wait, you know, I have a question for Jake Roberts. Go ahead. Why did you leave the WWE? Yeah. Because Jake the Snake Roberts has always been one that likes to push his own buttons. I like to control my own destiny. That's something you should think about. You're a young man right now. You should take the bull by the horns, not let somebody else push you down a garden path. And that's where exactly where I was at. I was uh, in a situation that I was unhappy with for the simple reason I wasn't in control. I will be in control at the WCW. That fatherly advice from Jake, Mr. <laughs> Rogers Roberts here. And let's go talk to uh, Scott in Rockmart, Georgia. You're on Wrestling with Jim Ross on AM 750, WSB, and Jake Roberts. How's it going, Jim? Good, thanks. I respect you. With, I got the utmost respect for you, but I got a question <laughs> who do you for know? you, Jeff. Uh, Jake, uh, does Undertaker, what does, that, what does that mean to you? That's why you left the WWF and you <laughs> tell everybody. Are you a brain surgeon? Evidently no, not, because you haven't got a clue as to why I leave. You know nothing about me. You know nothing about my business. The Undertaker is a great athlete, no doubt. But no match for a snake. Nothing is and never will be. Let's talk to uh, Richard in Winchester, Kentucky. Richard, you're on Wrestling with Jim Ross and Jake the Snake Roberts. Thanks for calling. Hey, John. How are you doing? Good. I just want to say, Jake, it's really great to have you back in wrestling again. <laughs> Um, my question was, I know that you and Rick Root had a feud in the WWF, and what I was wondering was, do you still harbor any resentment toward him, or has that been settled? Well, it was settled up there, but let me tell you something about athletes in a situation. It's not like it's a team here, you know, it's not a team in the WWF, you're individuals. A moment in time, I will strike anyone, whether it's the hand that feed me, or the hand that stepped on me, or the man that's done me wrong, I will bite at anyone. Uh, WCW, they promote competitive, you know, competition. That's the whole thing, man. Everybody wants that number one spot. Now, if I have to walk over Rude, fine. If it happens to be little Dustin Rhodes, who I squashed today, and I must admit, I can't apologize to my mom because it was something I enjoyed. Whoever it may be, I will do what it takes. That's what it's all about. Uh, thanks, Richard, for your call tonight from Winchester, Kentucky. Let's talk to uh, David Calling a little closer to home. He's in Shambly. Hi, David. How you doing, Jim Ross? Good, thanks. Uh, sorry about that. It was a tough loss Saturday night in Tampa Bay, but I hope to see you in the Dome this Sunday. Yeah, boy, it's going to be great. We're going to be on the air here on the radio at 11 o'clock Sunday morning for the uh, tailgate show, and the Eagles come to town. Less than 800 tickets are available. They're all singles. So I uh, hope the folks uh, get those tickets. It's going to be exciting, and uh, be sure and wear black, David. Oh, yeah, always. What's your, um, what's your qu comment or question for the snake? Would like to welcome Jake the Snake Roberts, a person I've, I've looked up to and have followed his career for many, many years back to the Atlanta wrestling area. That sounds like a uh, smart young man. And uh, my, my question is, Jake, um, I've known you as always being an impact player. I mean, I've, I've watched you and followed your career, but... And puzzled about your you dropping a cross on Sting's chest. Does that symbolize anything like... Not devil worshipping, if that's what you're thinking. Uh, that's not what it was about at all. All I was doing was challenging to Sting. You know, here's a man that stands in front of millions of people week by week and says, this is what to do, this is what to do, and this is what's going to happen for you. Sometimes parents, sometimes idols, sometimes heroes paint a picture that looks so easy to achieve and i was just telling sting here is the cross this is for you to bear if you can carry it, you try it in no way at all was i promoting devil worshiping because we've all got something to believe in fortunately for myself i believe in myself but there is a greater power than me whatever it is believe me Let's talk to Travis in Boston, Massachusetts. Travis, uh, you're on Wrestling with Jim Ross on AM 750 WSB and Jake the Snake Roberts. Hey, how you doing? Good. Good. Jake, I just want to tell you, I'm sure a lot of people are going to call up and complain about what you did. I think it was great, and I think it's about time someone put that punk stink right in his place. <laughs> I think see, you're just the man to do it. See, there are a lot of people out there, Jim Ross, that are tired of trading their heroes in for ghosts. 
And that's what I'm saying. I am the new thing, man. I am the new power standing up in the WCW. And I am going to give a lot of people an opportunity to worship or to idolize or to believe in something they can truly believe in. Not some false hero that's going to take a back door out. Because I'll tell you something. If you want the bank robbed, I'll rob it. I won't say that I'll walk in the front door. But I will rob it. Well, I know you've had a very busy weekend. I want to thank you for being with us here tonight. And uh, uh, you're always, at, uh, at the very least, a very unique guest. Well, I like to enjoy myself. But the worst thing about me in some people's eyes is that I'm brutally honest. And I'm going to be brutally honest right now. Cody, Cheryl, the people I care about. Daddy's here. Daddy's going to stay. That's just the way it's got to be. All right. Uh, our guest tonight, Jake the Snake Roberts, will be talking to Jesse the Body Ventura in our second half hour. I want to thank uh, the young man from Boston for giving us a call. Uh, all of our lines are full right now, but we do, do certainly hope you'll keep trying at 872-0750, 1-800-WSB-TALK. We'll talk to the body right after the news, and we'll be back after this time out. More with America's leading wrestling broadcaster. It's Wrestling with Jim Ross. You can talk with Jim Ross and his guests by calling 872-0750. Now, here's Jim Ross. Thanks very much and welcome back everyone to the program. Uh, we, we were talking to Jesse the Body Ventura, the premier color, color analyst in the sport of wrestling. Uh, in just a few moments, I do want to uh, uh, again uh, review a little bit. We have not talked about the results of the uh, NWA World uh, Heavyweight Tournament that just concluded a few days ago. I know that some of you have called about that. Uh, again, if you're trying to get uh, through, all nine lines are busy right now, but our number is 872-0750, 1-800-WSB-TALK. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson here to tell you a little more about what adfreeshows.com is all about. Get early ad-free access to more than a dozen of your favorite wrestling podcasts every single week, starting at just nine bucks. That's less than 20 cents an episode each month. And yes, you can listen to them all directly through Apple Podcasts or your regular podcast app. How easy is that? Ad-Free Shows also has thousands of hours worth of bonus content and docu-series like Title Chase, Eric Fires Back, Conversations with Conrad, and The Insiders. Plus new series like The Book with David Crockett, Monday Mailbags with Mike Kyoto and Nick Patrick, and a whole lot more. And you want to talk about early, you can't get any earlier than listening to the shows live. You can be a part of the live studio audience as we record the podcast. Plus ride shotgun alongside your favorite childhood heroes for live watch alongs, Q and A's and other interactive experiences every single month. Come on now, see for yourself what thousands of other wrestling fans from around the world have discovered that adfreeshows.com is the best value in wrestling. Check it out today. And hey, when you do, the first week is completely free at freeshows.com. <laughs> 